Hi guys, in this video I'm going to discuss on the kinds of polygons. So polygons are classified according to the number of sides. For example, if you're going to have a polygon with three sides, for example, if we're going to draw, draw that polygon, this is a polygon with three sides. So if we're going to have three sides, you can name that one as triangle. And if you're going to have four sides, that name will be quadrilateral. So, any polygon with four sides are called as quadrilateral. For example, if we're going to have a square. So, a square is an example of a quadrilateral. Another is rectangle. So, rectangle is another quadrilateral and another here is parallelogram this has four sides meaning this is also a quadrilateral and we also have trapezoid so trapezoid is also a quadrilateral then a polygon with five sides we're going to name that one as pentagon So, five sides is pentagon. Then, if you're going to have six sides, you can name that one as hexagon. Then, seven sides, you can name that one as heptagon. Eight sides will be octagon. Then, if we're going to have nine sides, that will be called as nonagon. Then, ten sides. Ten sides will be called as decagon. Then, eleven sides. You can call that one as andecagon. Then, twelve sides. You can name that one as Dodecagon. Now for the number of sides it is greater than 12. For example, 13. 13 sides. You can name that one as 13 gone. So 13 up, you can name that one as the number, then followed by gone. So if we're going to have a number of sides that is greater than 12, you can just call that one as n con. So this is for n sides. So the number of sides, n, then you can name that one as n con. For example, if we're going to have a polygon with 24 sides, you can name that one as 24 con and so on depending on the number of sides so i hope this video helped you if you have questions about the topic please comment down below and see you next time